Hello, in this short video I'll be reminding you of Kirchhoff's current law, or Kirchhoff's first law as it is often known. Kirchhoff's first law says that the sum of the currents entering a point in a circuit is equal to the sum of the currents leaving that point. Here are three branches of a circuit with the rest of the circuits hidden but we can just see these three branches. Let's say that uh, we measure the current here to be 5 amps and we measure the current coming out of this branch here to be 2 amps it means that this current here must be 3 amps we can write this more formally, we can say that the sum of the currents in is equal to the sum of the currents out so that is 5 is our current that is going into this point equals 3 plus 2. Let's now look at an example with uh, a more realistic circuit. So here we have a full parallel circuit. Let's say that we have measured the current in each of our two branches here. And we found that this current here is 3 amps. This current here is 6 amps. We can use Kirchhoff's current law, Kirchhoff's first law here, to deduce that this current here must be 9 amps, because the current's into this point. 9 equals 3 plus 6. And then let's have a look at the other side of this circuit. This branch here is just a one series branch, so this current here must be 6 amps. This current here must be 3 amps because this is one continuous series loop here and therefore 3 plus 6 equals 9 so this one must be 9 amps as well